The demonstration you'll see is part of a project at UC Berkeley that is funded by the National Science Foundation and co-funded by the Department of Transportation. Our goal in this project is to show that we can easily double or triple the capacity of intersections by moving vehicles in a formation. We call these vehicle formations vehicle platoons. They've been demonstrated before on dedicated lanes of highways. The challenge in this project was to do the same thing in city traffic. The vehicles use advanced control methodology, vehicle to vehicle communications, and vehicle to infrastructure communications. My name is Stan and I'm a grad student at UC Berkeley working on this NSF Department of Transportation project. Now I'll talk about some of the important devices in our fleet of test vehicles. So, so we have the communication device here, which is using the antenna on the top of the car to communicate with the traffic light. From the traffic light, we're receiving a current phase of the light, so that's if the light is red, yellow, or green, and then also an estimate on the remaining phase time, uh, which is from historical data. Um, the other two devices here are taking in information from the vehicle sensors and the information from the traffic light, and then using all of that information they take that into account and determine using an optimizer, using model predictive control, what is the best action that the vehicle can take um, over the next two seconds. So we're planning over the next two seconds. Once they determine what's the best action this vehicle can take, it sends that information to the other vehicles using the antenna, um, and then they react accordingly to maintain the formation of the vehicles with a six meter gap in between each.